big Philip Clement. He's never going to learn, troops. He's never, ever going to learn. So, let's talk about it. Jack Butland in goal. Can't really make any complaints there. But uh, let's go in to the complaints straight away. Because we've got James Tavern here. In at right back. I mean, you know what? He's the captain. He's always going to start because apparently that's some unwritten bylaw where it needs to be the thing. And I, mean, I could almost half accept having your starting right if it meant Chirney didn't start. But guess what, troops? Chirney starting. Kazan Weirdo, to me, was great against Malmo and he came on against Leon and we didn't concede a goal. To me, that's the, the proof in the pudding there that this kid on loan should be starting. Now, I get it, St. Johnson. It's not <clears throat> Europa League big boy stuff, but the league's big boy stuff, all right? In the centre-backs, we get proper and suitor. Again, pretty self-explanatory, isn't it? At the end of the day, uh, then we got Yefty. No complaints about him, but again, I think Kaz and Weirjo... Uh, <laughs> See at Rangers, it feels like we just don't reward good uh, good performances. You know, Connor Barron started literally every game in pre-season because we were doing to the bare bones. And that's the reason he's in there. Talking of Barron, you get him and Diamonde in the centre of the pitch, which I'm not going to complain about. Although, I feel like people are bipolar. When it comes to Diamonde, one minute, it's going between... He's brilliant. He's going to be worth the most this league's ever seen. And the next is why is Clement starting this guy over Nico Raskin. So people really need to uh, make their minds up. Then in front of them, we have got Bajrami, McCausland, and Churney. So that's a that's a positive for me in terms of Bajrami will be starting down the middle um, of the midfield because that's his favoured position. This guy looks like he's got something about him. Looks like our best player um, when he's on the ball, etc. etc. Cheerney is just bogging. Um, you know, I think there is a player somewhere in Cheerney, but the reality is he's on loan. And I mean, that probably the, the proof is in the pudding there. He's on loan. There's probably some form of, you know, I have to play X amount of YZ games. But again, ah. It'd be alright, like, if he was good, but he looks pish. And then up front, we've got Cereal, so we'll be back with a match a few soon, troops. Will it be good? It needs to be good. Right. <clears throat> I have no under... I have no idea why I said that Conor Barron was starting in the team ahead of... Nico Raskin, but... I did say that. Don't really understand what come on. Is went with that? I mean, is it because Barron made a mistake against Leon? Is it because he's tired? I mean, I, I don't know. But for me, I, honestly, I think that's embarrassing. Because that's like, Connor, that's like one of Conor Barron's first mistakes gets dropped. You know what? I like that attitude. But when it doesn't apply for 95% of the rest of the squad, you've got a problem. So, anyway, I thought I'd uh, correct myself there before I upload this. But uh, I mean, it's currently three minutes past seven. Let me get this wee cheeky starting 11. Upload it soon.